and lots of eyes are on the race for the next San Jose mayor. It's now down to just two candidates. Cindy Chavez was the top vote getter in last night's primary. Matt Mahan came up second, and as Lemmer Mayor's reports, both will now face off in the runoff in the fall. Well, this is shaping up to be a classic mayor's race here in San Jose with the experienced labor back candidate Cindy Chavez against the upstart business back candidate Matt Mahan. Cindy Chavez was right back at work the morning after finishing the June primary as the top vote getter in a crowded San Jose mayor's race with 39% of the vote. People are excited about a new change. They want the city cleaned up. They want to address affordable housing. They want San Jose to be the safest big city in America again. Across town, Matt Mahan was planning for the fall runoff with his supporters. He took 32% of the vote as a relative newcomer to politics. Our campaign has grown by leaps and bounds over the last few months. I think it's a testament to our message of common sense solutions on some of the big challenges we face. So it's shaping up to be um, a hot race, I San Jose think. State political um, science professor Melinda Jackson says the race will tighten up. There will be um, higher voter turnout and more moderate and conservative voters um, turning out. So I think it's going to be a tight race. In this, her second run at the mayor's office, Cindy Chavez says she has more leadership and problem-solving experience. I've had the experience of both being on the Board of Supervisors and playing a leadership role, for example, during COVID, of pulling all the mayors together from all of the cities. Um, and I think what people want is that kind of coordination, that kind of collaboration, that kind of outcome that really does move our community forward. Mahan, a former school teacher and business owner, says he'll take a business-like approach to solving the city problems. She certainly has a lot of experience. I just happen to think it's the wrong experience for this moment. We need new ideas. We need change. We need someone who isn't beholden to the way things are. She represents the politics of the past, the, the status quo, and it's time to break from that and increase accountability for results in government. Both campaigns are not wasting any time as the final showdown for the mayor's office is underway. In San Jose, Len Ramirez, KPIX 5.